I already know your valve cover gasket is bad and it's time to change it. Welcome back to Top 5 Auto Repairs. How do you know you have a bad valve cover gasket? The first sign that you know that your valve cover gasket is going bad is going to be engine leak. If you have engine leak starting at the top end of your engine and you see that your valve cover is covered in uh, engine oil and you see a lot of dirt accumulated on it, there's a good chance that valve cover gasket is bad and it's time to replace it. If your valve cover gasket is extremely bad, for example, it can easily snap into pieces, this going to allow engine oil to seep out of your valve cover. Basically, that engine oil is going to start to flow on top of the exhaust and, it's gonna, and you're going to notice a strong burning smell. On top of that, if too much engine oil is being dumped on top of the exhaust manifold, you're going to notice a lot of smoke coming out of that area as well. The next sign that you know that your valve cover gasket is bad is going to be engine oil accumulated on top of the uh, spark plug. If you're starting to get an engine misfire and you pull out the ignition coil and suddenly see a lot of engine oil on it and on top of the uh, spark plug, that's going to be caused by bad spark plug tube seal. So basically every time you buy the, the uh, valve cover gasket, it always comes in a kit like this. It's going to come with the uh, tube seal as well. Basically this tube seal can also become bad, it can start to harden and it can start to break and when this happens, it's going to allow engine oil to seep inside the spark plug tube seal and it's going to cause the uh, spark plug to be soaking engine oil, again causing that engine misfire. There are a lot of reasons why valve cover gasket goes bad. And number one is going to be natural wear and tear. And by natural wear and tear, you have a lot of mileage on your engine and it's going to cause the valve cover gasket to start to harden and start to break and start to split as well. The second common reason why valve cover gasket also go bad is going to be maybe your engine overheated at some point. If your engine overheated, it's going to cause again these components to start to harden, become brittle and crack. Let's just say you had your valve cover gasket replaced at some point and let's just say a year later or two and suddenly it fails again. I'm going to tell you exactly the reason why it is failing again so quickly. The first common reason is that most likely your valve cover wasn't properly torqued or let's just say it was tightened but it was way over tightened and it caused your gasket to split. So basically here's your valve cover right here and you want to tighten all the bolts evenly. If you do not tighten all the bolts evenly, it's going to cause the uh, oil to seep somewhere in one area of the valve cover. The second most common cause is going to be not putting silicone in these corners right here. So basically if you have any edge that looks kind of like this, that's, that uh, the valve cover gasket is not going to cover that area. So you must apply silicone in that area. If you do not apply silicone, again, it's going to cause engine oil to leak out eventually. The next most common cause, and I see it all the time, it's either somebody worked on a valve cover or a gasket and broke a few bolts, or sometimes these bolts are missing on the valve cover. Again, all that's going to contribute to oil coming out of the valve cover. If you have a V-block engine and you have a very bad valve cover gasket, all the engine oil is going to start to sit on top of the uh, engine area. And basically you're starting to have a little puddle of engine oil right there. And what's going to happen is that as you're driving, you're going to constantly have that burning smell. As always, thank you for watching. Subscribe to Top 5 Auto Repairs.